Alrighty, folks. This is bare naked paw paw grafting. Half naked, anyway. So, this is my rootstock. This is a paw paw sapling uh, coming into its second year. Uh, I planted it here directly as a seed to make it the strongest roots possible. But now I'm going to graft it. I've got some cyan wood from Sue. Sweet Sue. Sue is a pawpaw that is on the sweet side. Sort of like Shenandoah. For those who don't like really strong pawpaw flavor, Sue's a, a sweet choice. So I got cyan wood here. On this cyan wood, on some pieces, you'll see there's a lot of fruit buds. That does not make good cyan wood. I need buds that are gonna leaf. So, scrap that piece. And I'm looking for something, ideally about a quarter inch thick, really healthy, plump buds on it. And I'm gonna choose three. If you choose more, you're in danger of drying out your scion. So I snipped the bottom. The top of it I snipped at an angle, just above the bud. So, I'm going to match up the size of my cyan wood with the pawpaw. Boom. I'm going to get out my trusty grafting knife. And this is called a cleft cut. So, I'm coming down very carefully through the center. Coming down almost a knife's depth. Pulling that out. Now on my cyan wood, I'm going to cut two angled cuts. Boom. Nice and thin and smooth. Now I'm going to come over and open this up a little bit. Slide these two together. Oh yeah. That's a thing of love right there. Now I'm going to use my, my buddy tape. This is grafting tape. This is good grafting tape. Don't buy cheap grafting tape. It sucks to work with. This stuff's a little more expensive, but look, it stretches nicely. I'm gonna overlap that. I'm gonna squeeze it while I wrap it. Squeeze it while I wrap it. This is all about preserving the moisture so that the cambiums, that lime green layer that grows right under the bark of trees lines up and heals you see I'm gonna wrap the whole thing carefully only to put one thin wrap over the bud but this also is gonna give me added moisture protection doesn't hurt so why not do it especially over the top if it's been cut you want to seal that boom it's like a cocoon. Sweet. That'll meld together, begin to grow, depending on the weather. You might see some leaf push through in about three weeks. That's it, Long Creek Homestead.